Alright, so I got this cheap video camera from Deal Extreme. It was twelve dollars. Came with a lens. It's it's fairly sensitive. Uh, the problem with it, the, the lens is rather wide angle too, which is nice. The problem is it doesn't come with a filter. So I went on eBay and um, I got this uh, IR block filter and and hot glued it to the end of the lens. And that really helped the daylight image a lot and made a nice, pretty color daylight image. The problem is the lens is such a wide angle lens, it suffers from a lot of off axis aberrations out in the corner of the video screen. It gets really, really ugly. So to solve that, we have put a, what I'm going to call a sub aperture mask. Uh, it's a it's not a pinhole, it's just a hole. Um, it's larger than a pinhole, it's not working like a pinhole. Um, but I put it back on the, um, the lens closest to the, uh, the, the imager, and, um, and it seems to really clean things up a lot. Um, it's underneath the uh, IR block filter, and uh, because if I put it on the IR block filter, it worked, but you got a, a vignetting and um, it was, you know, the corners were now dark and shadowy, uh, but they're in focus, which was nice. So I put it down here on this field lens, and um, all that is is a piece of uh, um, copper-colored pinstripe material, basically. It's an adhesive back copper, and um, I punched a little hole in it, and then um, stuck it down there on the lens and stuck it in place with the adhesive that was on it. And um, we'll see what that does for us. <laughs>